Gamers spend more than $100 billion a year on video games, and surprisingly, most of that actually comes from the purchase of in-game digital items. Fortnite, for example, sold over a billion dollars in in-game items just within their first year of launching. That's a free-to-play game that gamers have spent more than a billion dollars on, and they don't have any claim to those items. That's because in Fortnite, like in most other games, players don't actually own the items that they're purchasing, even if they spend hundreds or sometimes thousands of dollars on them. So who does own the items? If you read the terms of service for most video games, you'll see that even though the player purchased the items and has them in their inventory, the game's creator ultimately owns and controls the items. That doesn't seem fair. But thankfully, that's starting to change as both gamers and game developers are starting to realize the benefits of allowing players to buy, sell, trade, and use their items however they wish. This concept is something that the WAX team has spent decades working on and perfecting. We call this true ownership of digital items, and it's finally becoming a reality thanks to blockchain technology. You can see this in a study that we commissioned of 500 video game developers and 1,000 video game players in the United States. What we found is that people on both sides of the fence agree that when players truly own their items and can use and trade them how they wish, everybody wins. 66% of game developers surveyed said that in-game item purchases are a pivotal component of their game's monetization strategy. And an astonishing 86% of game developers said that tradable virtual items will be even more important in future games than they are today. So when you combine that with the 68% of video game players who said they feel that they deserve to truly own their items, you can start to see why more and more video games are adopting true ownership of digital items. It's just too important to both sides to continue without it. Right now, in-game items are severely restricted in their use. In most cases, players can only use the items in the original game that they were purchased for. And if they are able to sell the items, there's restrictions on who they can sell to, for how much money, and on which marketplaces. And what's more is that the items become valueless once the player has moved on to a different video game or video game platform. But by allowing true ownership, and therefore allowing players to trade these items however they want, Players can take their old items that they no longer have use for and trade them for new items that they actually want. So that could mean trading a PUBG trench coat for CryptoKitty and then trading that CryptoKitty for a pair of sneakers or converting the items into value outside of the video game, selling them on a marketplace for real life money, which they can then use to pay rent or buy a cheeseburger or whatever. When you start to see these applications, you can understand why 60% of game players surveyed said that they would be more likely to purchase items if they could trade or sell them to other players. And one of the most surprising findings from the survey is that game developers also agree with this concept. So what gets really interesting is where you have these gamers and you have these video game developers and they all want to play nice with each other, the possibilities are really exciting. Imagine if players could use the same set of in-game items across multiple different games. That's something that game developers seem to be particularly excited about, considering that 84% of them surveyed said that they would create items that could be used in multiple different games. And 72% of video game players surveyed said that they would be more likely to purchase in-game items if they could be used in more than one game. This, like all other scenarios we're describing, is made possible by the WAX platform's use of blockchain technology. So what do we learn? True ownership of digital items is the future of video games. Gamers and game developers both agree on this, and WAX is building that future to make true ownership a reality. Come and join us.